everyone. As you can tell, I'm okay. But this trip from Montserrat to Manresa wasn't quite what I expected. In my last video about Montserrat, I came close to the Black Madonna statue. According to legend, the statue was found around the year 880 by a group of shepherd boys in a cave on Montserrat. The bishop wanted to transfer it down to Manresa, but the statue grew increasingly heavy when people tried to move it from the cave. As you would have seen in that video, the statue wasn't that big, so it was interpreted as the wish of St. Mary to stay in the mountains. I was curious as to what might have been the Black Madonna's home, so my first stop is Santa Maria de Manresa, also known as La Sioux. It's hard not to compare churches and cathedrals. Once you've been inside La Sagrada Familia, or St. Paul's Cathedral, Notre Dame, you start counting the number of stained glass windows, the shiny objects. Especially with a Gothic architecture such as this, the interior looks dark, the vaults and pillars bare. Where are all the tourists? But, when the outside world is so noisy, this peace and simplicity is just what we need.
Growing up in Hong Kong, I was familiar with Jesuit ministries from Spain who founded Catholic schools in Asia, and also the work of Italian Jesuit Matteo Ricci in China, etc. But I know very little about saints, maybe because they sound too holy. Now that I've learned more about St. Ignatius, my childhood education and my faith suddenly make so much more sense. 